Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. This is Abby and I am an intuitive reader. So, we will be doing your monthly reading. A general reading for October 2023. Okay? And, um, I already put the disclaimer before the reading starts. And, um, before anything else, I would like to let you know, guys, um, I haven't done any readings in the past few months because I was on medication and I just had my surgery a few weeks ago. And then I had to complete my review and take an exam, an exam which I gladly pass. All right. So enough of that. So I already pre-shuffled the cards. We're not going to read reversals, but we will clarify the card when necessary. All right. So this is for our beloved Libra for the month of October 2023. General reading. So we will be pulling seven cards in your spread. Uh, we will look into what do you need to release, to keep, what do you need to manifest, the surrounding energies right now in your general life. What do you need to give to others, new beginnings and some lessons that you have not learned or about to learn or you have already learned all right okay we will not also going to uh pick flying cards because in the traditional practice okay according to the rider weight tarot deck you know um we have to honor and respect the cards so i always lay them out carefully on our tarot table right Okay. Thank you for your support and for holding on. I appreciate it, guys. All right. Let's see. For our beloved Libra. Okay. Okay, so you at the center you have lessons. You need to learn or about to learn or maybe you have already learned. All right. Let's see. You have the four of wands you have the wow another four four of pentacles and then you have the queen of cups it's just okay here here i'll show you guys the queen of cups okay let's just so it's not visible okay but anyway i'll show you and then you also have the another four four of swords mm -hmm. what's going on here okay interesting libra you have the queen of pentacles your sixth card the fifth will be the hierophant libra and the at the center you have the world okay so in a snapshot um i feel like um there is this connection or a household situation um where you are heavily involved or committed or engaged that you had to let go okay maybe you have not let go of this person or it could be a relationship a commitment or a marriage okay but you know the contrary here is that you need to hold on to it for some reason it could be your your resources that you need to to hold on for now you could be saving up as well if it has something to do with your career you're trying to manage on the resources that you have right now okay if it has something to do with the connections around you you have to you know um save something for yourself do not drain um your energy your resources time and effort okay that's what you need to save for yourself okay but i feel like maybe there's something going on like a collapse or a shaking up that's about to happen or already happening right now or it could be in a recent past about a uh, a home situation you know a domesticated situation here where it's you know you're going to have to rebuild it or you need to let it you know crumble for now in order to rebuild it okay but we will clarify this okay but um i think you're still manifesting the a very loving energy around you that's what you want okay 
um there's still a room for you libra to love you have so much love to give and that's a good thing although you feel like you know there was this ending or about to crumble you know your worlds are about to crumble um there are connections that's starting to fall apart or there are resources and situation and energy you need to also save for yourself to take care for yourself because you also need to fend and protect yourself at the same time you still have this um ability you know to nurture others to love other people and to love yourself okay but if you are manifesting this loving nature of you the broad it's still a reminder here that you also need to save something for yourself okay in any area so be it emotionally physically or uh, even your mental um um you know prowess okay to ability to think through about demanding or challenging situations okay um the current energies right now actually it's good because you are in the four of swords energy here so you're trying to be at peace with the situation with yourself okay um actually you're probably in a state of just taking care of yourself for now and having you know not really making any decisions or actions in any areas of your life it's like you're in a stalemate with your situation you feel like um you're stuck but stuck in a good way like um even if it's not making any progress right now you are contented with your um surrounding energies your family the people that's surrounding you your friends you could be getting a lot of support as well and you could be getting a lot of rest you know these things um, I'm a Libra, so I would relate to this um, surrounding energy, you know, because I just got out from a surgery and I'm just healing. Basically, it's about resting, physically resting myself. So that's just one example. It could also be, you know, you're trying to free your mind from anxiety, from worry, from toxicity from other people. It could also be decluttering your connections, your surrounding areas, even your household. You could be starting to clean up. Um, even in your workspace, you could be, you know, trying to have a good relationship or be at peace on whatever you are doing or whatever you are contributing to the organization or with your team, okay? Now, um, what do you need to give to others? You have a major arcana libra. You have the hierophant. We will clarify this because the hierophant has something to do with morals, with your belief system. It could also be very spiritual. So, it could relate to, you know, giving a sense or a part of you that's you know it's not based on tangible things but something that's you know innate to you it could be your wisdom it could also be your spiritual strength you could be influencing others by you know giving them spiritual support you know giving them uplifting their spirits it could also be um a perfect time for you to um, you know, be more vocal about what you believe in, your moral code, your moral compass. You could be an inspiration to others, okay? That's what the Hierophant symbolizes. And um, for new beginnings to you, there will be abundance, Libra. Queen of Pentacles. So um, this is what you're trying to manifest, right? The Queen of Cups, okay? And at the same time, what you will have is a new beginning about... You know your material possessions it will improve it could be you will find a new job with big salary it could be you know moving to bigger house acquiring you know new properties that could elevate your um money your financial success or it could be a financial windfall all right and um all right so even if you're holding on to your resources i feel like there will be a or your time your energy your effort there will be an increase of that okay thousand fold okay libra i don't know what you are going through right now what you are working on but eventually in any initiative that you're doing related to your security and stability i feel like it will greatly improve for the month of october 2023 there will be like movement and changes positive movement it could also be a giant leap from whatever you have right now it will increase like 10 times or five times more right it could be your business just starting up and then eventually by end of october entering november you will expect you know a great increase in your uh revenue 
your business no sales no this is just an example and for the lessons learned libra you have the world so something has come to an end and there was you know um there was this sudden um and they could be abrupt it could be a wrapped up of a situation it could be a connection or an ending in your career and um could also be in business whatever it is that you know this has something to do what you need to release guys i feel strongly it has something to do with that but at the same time there will be a comeback here okay like i said earlier there will be a rebuild if there is something has to crumble here or has to end don't you worry because the world is starting a new cycle okay or it completely a new beginning of like i said a financial um success for you okay um it could be um getting a new job that offers a higher salary that's just an example okay so um i hope this so i hope that this is snapshot of your general reading helps you a uh, libra to have some guidance for this month okay now let's move on to your love life okay let's move on to your love life let's see let's just shuffle the cards libra for your love life So Libra, these are your cards for your love situation this month of October 2023. Let's take a look. Okay, you have Six of Swords, Nine of Pentacles, Six of Wands, wow. Ace of Wands, the Hermit. Okay, so we will clarify each card before we start your reading libra okay all right let's take a look these are your cards libra so you have ace of pentacles here okay clarify the six of swords i just have to show you because it's not showing in the camera all right and then you have this card here major arcana Six of Wands, you have, wow, Two of Cups. Nice. Ace of Wands, Page of Swords. Okay. The Hermit, Libra, you have the Queen of Wands. Okay. Interesting. So, I feel like um, it could be a new connection or an existing connection. Okay. So, um, feel free. So, from what I'm seeing here is that you're moving on from a difficult situation it could be away from an old connection and you're moving towards a new beginning okay a new offer here it could also be pertaining to an existing person trying to reconnect with you offering you something tangible this time okay now why did i say i feel like it's strongly an old connection because there was this death card here it's a major icon so the death card is like you know there was an ending and um that's trying to to be you know to be resurrected okay and um this transformation will be major because this person here is offering this ace of pentacles has the potential for it to grow you know in a long-term commitment Okay, this person you're connecting with and um they really will come in very strong and hot here the six of wands um okay the six of wands they will pursue okay they will chase they will make an effort here okay that's about victory and success what is that success they want to do with with you it's the two of cups it's the connection here it's the mutual love the mutual um um, passion at the same time in attraction is divinely guided it's very spiritual okay um you they want to make you fall in love with them and they're in love with you okay there's a strong soul connection here and at the same time there will be a restart here with this connection libra for the month of october 2023 expect a restart that restart will be coming in from or through a message the page of swords okay there will be a communication here and the communi communication 
could be you know fiery and hot and steamy it could also be be flirtatious you no know? um and sexual okay but at the same time don't think that it's all about lust or sexual because the energy of six of wands here what they really want on at the base or at, from their heart is to come together with you okay this person could be you know going through a phase of you know reviewing what they need to do here okay with you because they're very attracted to this queen of wands and that is you libra okay um maybe um at one point before this person comes in you were on a um disconnect with them you're not talking to them you're in no contact okay and this person while in that ceasefire or non-action or no communication they're thinking thoroughly about this okay if they haven't told you they actually um thinking about you heavily okay you are on their mind heavily they're reviewing what happened in the past you know and eventually they will come to their senses that they're really attracted to you okay they see you as someone's um confident um gorgeous beautiful and at the same time you could be attracting so many admirers as well okay and they put you in the high pedestal this person so um expect a message just coming from this person for the month of october 2023 so um libra i hope the general reading about your life and your love reading resonates with you and i see you guys on the next monthly reading take care libra thank you for the support and the channel love you guys bye